went undefeated through the entire King of Iron Fist Tournament 3, and even triumphed over Ogre. Swelling with pride, Paul returned home. However, unknown to Paul, Ogre morphed into his second form, True Ogre, and the tournament continued after his departure. Although Paul claimed that he was the true champion of the King of Iron Fist Tournament 3, few believed him. And even those who did eventually grew tired of his attitude. Eventually, his dojo went out of business from the lack of students. One day, Paul spotted a newspaper flyer announcing the King of Iron Fist Tournament 4. desire to win this tournament, Paul decided to put his reputation on the line and prove once and for all that he was the one true champion. He proclaimed, this time, I'll be the undisputed champion. Round 1 Fight! Let's go! Round one. Fight! <laughs> Round 
two. Fight. Come on! Round one. Fight! <laughs> Round one. Fight. <laughs> Round one. Fight. <laughs>
one. Fight. Alright, let's take a cab. Welcome to the King of Iron Fist Tournament 4. Christy Montiero. Eddie Gordo learned capoeira from a master during his imprisonment. This master had a granddaughter named Christy. 
While in prison, Eddie swore an oath to him that he would pass on the art of capoeira to Christie. Shortly after returning from the King of Iron Fist Tournament 3, Eddie took Christie under his wing and taught her the art of capoeira, just as he promised. She became an impressive fighter after two years of training. But Eddie left abruptly soon thereafter. Those responsible for my father's death must pay. His words were all that was left behind for Christie. By his sudden and mysterious disappearance, Christie pursued Eddie, her only lead, the King of Iron Fist Tournament. Here we go! Round one. Fight! Round two, fight! Baby, show me what you got. Round one. Fight. <laughs> Win. 
to fight. Did you hurt yourself? Round one. Fight. <laughs> Round one, fight!
fight!
new scene. Yeah, oh, that's good. Anyone you want to share this victory with? So tell us, what was the key to your victory? Welcome to the King of Iron Fist Tournament 4. Martial Law Martial Law was a successful businessman. He managed a newly established dojo and owned a successful nationwide Chinese fast food chain called Marshall China. Unfortunately, he lost a franchise war against a competing restaurant chain and had to declare bankruptcy a year later. Unable to cope with failure, Marshall fell into depression and spent his days at home on his couch in a drunken haze. Then one day, a notice for the tournament arrived at his doorstep. Marshall's eyes flashed with renewed vigor. After a month of intense training, he beat himself back into top physical form. This is it, he said to himself. It's all or nothing. The fire within him raged hotter than ever before. Round one. Fight. Perfect. You win. Round two. Fight.
fight. Fight! Yeah! Oh. 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 Yeah!
man, the food here sucks! We have to pay for this? What did you just say? You heard me, I said this food sucks! You expect us to eat this stuff? What do you mean it sucks? This pepper beef is too damn spicy! <laughs> What are you talking about? This is good. Dance a bit more and... that he had lost touch with his wild instincts. Welcome to the King of Iron Fist Tournament 4. Panda. After the last tournament, Panda accompanied Xiaoyu back to Mishima High School. Since then, Panda spent her days training with Xiaoyu. On some days, she wondered, just a little, about the whereabouts of Kuma, who disappeared after the tournament. One day, two years after the tournament, a preoccupied Xiaoyu mentioned the announcement for the King of Iron Fist Tournament 4. After hearing Xiaoyu's concerns about the tournament and the Mishima Zaibatsu, Panda decided to become Xiaoyu's bodyguard once again. Here we go! Round 1. Fight! Go! Soon up. Round one. Fight. <laughs>
Round 1. Fight. Round 
two. Fight. <laughs> Round 
。ねえ、重要な話って何え、なになにうわー、懐かしいパンダ、この写真大事にしてたっけでも、どうして急にあ、ジンわかった。一緒に探しに行くってこと私一人でどうして二人で世界中を探し回ろうよ。嫌だよ一緒に行こうよ<笑>そっか。もしかして自分が保護動物だってこと気にしてでも<笑>よっわかった一人で行ってくるずっと友達だよ Welcome to the King of Iron Fist Tournament 4. Panda! After the last tournament, Panda accompanied Xiao Yu back to Mishima High Iron Fist Tournament 4. After losing to Paul Phoenix in the last tournament, Kuma realized that he had lost touch with his wild instincts. He realized that as long as he remained Heihachi's pet, he would be unable to use his instincts to his advantage. Thus, Kuma trained alone in the mountains of Hokkaido, determined to regain his powers. Life in the wilderness was more brutal than any training Kuma had endured under Heihachi. Despite this, Kuma continued his harsh regimen. He burned with a desire to defeat Paul. His efforts eventually paid off. His skills improved dramatically, and he even developed new attacks of his own. Kuma could not give up was his addiction to television. Every so often he went down to the village and watched TV through the villagers' windows. During his second year of training, Kuma went down to the village as usual. While looking through the window of one particular house, he saw a television commercial announcing the King of Iron Fist Tournament 4. Kuma's instincts burned for battle as he headed towards the tournament site. Paul would be at the tournament, and Kuma was determined to defeat him. Round 1 Fight!
Round 1. Fight.
Round one. Fight. <laughs>
クマよその契約書に母音を押すのじゃ。Welcome to the King of Iron. 